when I was a cub, we learned about putting four pennies into a telephone box and pressing button A if they answered and button B if they didn't. I got a badge for that. <laughs> there are some blank looks among my younger colleagues at that. But now, learning about money is a bit more complicated, as Moneybox reporter Stefania Okereke found when she joined the first Sunbury on Thames Cub Scouts to find out about the recently launched Money Skills Activity Badge. I need two um, strips of tape, um, five pieces of so this evening, the Cubs, they're currently doing something where they're looking at buying different items. Um, so they're exchanging the new hearty pound for different things to build a tower. It's getting them to think about how they're spending their money and where they need to budget and buy. Five pieces of tokens gets you one piece of paper. So do you want a piece of paper and a piece of tape? Would that work better? Uh, I want to become a chef, so I need to save up for a chef knife. But that costs money, so I need to not spend on sweets and other stuff. I just need to sort out my money. Scouts are committed to developing skills for life, and that means making sure that they're ready to become the adults that are needed in the world that's changing around them all the time. Money is a key part, not only in everyone's life, but also in the scout experience. Money is changing every day, and making sure that young people are understanding the impact of things like online purchases into their real life is really important. How much did you know about money before, before not joining this? Not much. I do spend money, but my mum normally helps me find as much as I need. Money helps you get stuff to do what you want to do. I like to be a doctor and to help with people. And to help with people, I need money to get the stuff. Why is it important to learn about money? Because um, if you um, like waste all your money, you won't know what to do um, when you're older and you'll use all your money so you won't have any more. Who likes spending money? So there are two money skills activity badges. There's one for beavers and one for cubs. So the different requirements, uh, for example, for the six to eight-year-olds would be how might you collect something, be it saving money or something else. So making sure that they are practising that, that feeling of what it's like to grow something and not having something immediately. What did you learn today? I learned that don't waste your money on stuff you really don't need because it ends up in a bad result. How are you going to use what you learned today when you go home in the future? Do not spend so much money or else you're going to get broke. Can I just make sure, did you have any fun tonight? Yes! yes! It sounds like you didn't have any fun at all. Yes! Okay, okay, okay. Oh, yeah. And we heard there from Scout leader Stuart, badge programme designer Amy, as well as Cub Scouts Neve, Thomas, Samuel, Lily and Logan in Stefania's report. Do you know, I wonder if the Moneybox team could get that money skills badge. Maybe we'll have a go. Well, I hope